look what we found here. A piece of rugos coral fragment among the alluvium. The predominant rock in this area is limestone. There are other types of rock here, but the majority of what is to be found in this area is limestone. And there's the piece of coral fragment that was being examined earlier. A lot of fossils are found in areas where there is a lot of limestone and that has a lot to do with why the limestone is here. Rugos coral has a skeleton that is made of calcite. Limestone contains calcite. Limestone is a carbonate rock. One of the minerals found in limestone is calcite. It is important to understand how limestone is formed. Millions of years ago, this area was covered by the sea. There were a lot of marine species with shells. Shells having calcium carbonate in it. And as the seas receded and those animals died off, the shells coral fragments, those were all left behind. The limestone formed out of those shells, out of the calcite that was in all of those shells, out of calcium carbonate. That is how limestone forms. And this is why fossils can be found in areas with a lot of limestone. This is why areas with a lot of limestone have fossils because of what the fossils are comprised of. Fossils like rugose coral, which are made of calcite, limestone, which also has calcite, fossils, shell fragments, stuff that contains calcium carbonate, stuff that helps to form the limestone. If you like this video, check out other videos on this channel. And as always, be sure to leave a comment, like, and subscribe.